National Seafood Month is observed in the month of October. Congress proclaimed National Seafood Month over 30 years ago to recognize one of the nation's oldest industries. And it's time to celebrate the United States as a global leader in sustainable seafood. And we begin our celebration in Hawaii with one of our local seafood favorites, poke. Your parents, Kim Brook, started this. So how did they begin this legacy and how are you continuing it? So my mom and dad started this business 26 years ago um, just for extra income. And um, word of mouth just got out and we got super popular. You know, our we use fresh uh, fish. We get every day from the, from the fish market. And it's... Uh, fresh local ingredients that you know we're we're based on quality and it's just just doing it the same way every single day and now visiting with the other half of the brood couple in lance and you know cynthia and kim they're talking about um how the family element about the restaurant is so important and it continues not just from her mom's side of the family but into today it's part of what you guys do. It is, and I'm really blessed by that because I have my entire family working for our program. Got my teenage daughters doing the sales. I've got my 23-year-old daughter. She runs a store in Kalama Valley. She's learned from her mom, learned from her grandmother. I've got my son. Um, it's a, a sister and brother team from Kaiser High School. They run the Kalama Valley shop, and my son cuts all of our fish. Everybody's engaged. It's a blast. It's really fun. But as a dad, to have your kids coming up third generation into a family business, sashimi grade ahi underneath that fabulous yeah. saucing. Okay. I love the spice. It's like spicy, but it's just the flavors are very subtle. I, oh, yeah. it's very, and you can tell. You can tell, taste the freshness. I tell people to count to ten after you eat the spicy, you. and you wow. get a little zing in the corner of your lip. Yeah. Nice and wow. comfortable. <laughs> Glad you enjoy it. 